Hello, Jonathan Landeros for Kativ Technologies. In this week's video, I'm going to show how you can see older file names for a file that's been renamed in Autodesk Vault. This one's a real easy one to show, so let's not talk about it and let's take a look. Here I am inside of Autodesk Vault Explorer, and I'm going to rename this file 8sideddie.ipt to D8 to match the naming convention of the other dice inside this folder, D10, D12, D20, and so on. But I do want to maintain a record of the original name and be able to view it later if I need to. The first thing I need to do is show the property. So I'm going to come down to my pane here, right click on the title bar, and choose Customize View. Now I'll go ahead and choose Fields, and I'm going to locate File Name Historical. Click Add, accept that, and then close the following dialog box where I can see the historical name for this die. Now, right now, it's still got its original name, so the file name on the left and the file name historical on the right will be the same. But now, I'm going to right click and rename my file. Go through the wizard and give that file a new name, which is d8.ipt. Vault will go ahead and rename that and finish it, and now it creates a second version for the renamed file. Here, if we look at the columns, I can now see that the new file name is d8, but the file name historical now shows up as 8 sided die, so it does remember what that original name was. So there is a record of what file names this file has been called, all maintained inside a vault. It's just a matter of showing that field. But there is more. We're not done yet. I'm going to go ahead and search for the original file name 8 sided die. Notice the file still comes up. So Vault remembers what that original file name is, it will let us display what that original file name is, and it can still find the file based on that original file name. So there's something else to remember about Autodesk Vault. It's tracking the history all the time, so if you don't know what the current name of the file is, but maybe know the old name, you can still get there from here. So that's it for this video. Have a great week, everybody.